9.30 a.m. in Las Vegas, Nevada. There is another show here, and a lot of Middle Eastern fragrances are gonna be there. Dumont, Fragrance World, Armoff. And so I'm walking there, it's about a six minute walk. There's the convention center. I'm gonna be real, man, I'm pretty beat. Just flew in from Italy yesterday. Got here at about nine, what time was it? I think it was 9.30 p.m. here. Got, I slept like a rock though. Got some sleep, woke up, no coffee, no breakfast. Heading into the convention center. Vegas, man, is crazy. All lights and clubs and casinos. Not my scene, that's not my lifestyle, but it's a nice view to like kind of just, not even view, it's just a different experience, I should say. It's nice though, if that's what you're into, it's really nice. I honestly wasn't expecting to come, so I just packed enough. But thankfully, I packed a little bit more than I needed for Italy. Literally like two outfits more, but it worked out. It was freezing in Italy though, like 40 degrees, so packed a bunch of sweaters, boots, and, um, but it worked out because I packed some of these Oxfords I have on with Chelsea boots. So it's about 40 degrees Fahrenheit in Italy here. I wouldn't say it's that warm today. Maybe it's just early, it's around 60 degrees, 55. Best band perfumes. What's happening, man? <laughs> so, man. My customer I'm, from Long Pine, 25 years. Hey, that's what's up. Nice shades. Yeah. Look at them styling. Did you see the new Nitro Red? The limited edition? Oh, let me Have you see. smelled this one or no? Yeah. Nitro Red? Long A while ago. This is stronger. They just came out with the six straight. Let me spray you real quick. Tell me what you think. So, I didn't even introduce you guys. We are here at Vegas. Just ran into... Introduce Christian, yourself. Christian O, Best Brands Perfume. Best Brands Perfume. Check out his YouTube channel. He's also on YouTube. So, I don't know. You sprayed the original before, no? You've smelled it? Oh, this is a new one? This is the Extrait for oh, Extract. Wow. So, Nitro Red. You guys know I love Nitro Red. This is a stronger version. It's like Jolly Rat, like Watermelon Jolly Rancher yeah. or something. It smells strong. It's sick. First booth of the day is going to be Dumont Paris. Checked out some of these fragrances. These are the Nitro series. I love these, except now they're in limited edition. And these are supposed to be stronger. They're all extrait de parfums versus the eau de parfum as if it wasn't already loud enough. Blue is a new discovery of mine, loving it. This is a new line as well. It's called Morjan. I smelled a couple of these. This is crazy good. It's called Kelimat. Kelimat, and we've got a few of them, but let's let the owner tell us a little bit about the brand, Mr. Diljeet yes, sir. Singh. How you doing, brother? Good, man. How are you? Very good to meet you, man. Love the fragrances, love the brand. Um, and this is, we were talking about this during a live stream. Yes. Yeah. And you this were telling me about this one, Chris yeah. Rock was buying it yeah, or something. Yeah, That's Eddie crazy. Murphy. We've had like baseball players, NBA players, we're getting DMs from everyone. Sold out three times already. Kelly Matt. Kelly Matt, yeah. This is a, Fruity, lychee, sweet, unisex. Yes, addictive. I love it. Super addictive. And it's not, it'll be available soon. We're still out of stock, but we'll have it soon. Available soon. Okay, so can you tell us a little bit about the brand of Dumont, when you started? Uh, what's your like, what's your vibes, man? What's your energy about this brand? Where do you want to go? And your mottos. So we started just a few years ago, distributing it. The brand's been around for 25 years. Wow. But our vision for it is we want to keep growing. We've done a lot in the last two, three years gotten a lot of presence all over the world. But just for the past few years, it's gotten a lot of traction. Our vision is to just make this at a much bigger level. I mean, yeah. the fragrance speaking for itself, Nitro 100%. Red is the latest discovery, so. Yeah, I mean, it's like you said, I, I've heard about them and then I couldn't get my hands on Nitro Red for a while. Yes. Just recently got my hands on it and wow, yes. you guys probably have the highest quality smelling cheapies. Yeah, people are loving it. I mean, there's nothing like it. It's not a, it's, it's a, it's a new scent. It's, yeah. No one has anything similar to it. Amazing. And it's addictive. Amazing. So let's take, let's, I'm going to take you with me if you don't mind. Okay. Let's take a look at some of your products and some of your scents. Okay. Some of the ones that really stood out the most to me or for me are some of the ones that we see here. Like Vert, this right here smells like an excellent, like a ventasy, but blended with Sauvage. It's like a loud sauvage, but um, nitro white. That's the latest wow, edition. Wow, man. 
Wow, the latest edition. So when did this release? This release about six, seven months ago, but it's been out of stock since it came out. And now wow. we finally got it back. And it's been selling, it's, I would say it's like number two to Nitro Red right now. It's like this creamy, sales. nutty, sexy, just amazing, man. Yeah. And the Axons, Axons, this is amazing right here also. Axon sold out till June, I'm trying to get it back. It's like this uh, aqua, marine, sweet, sexy. Uh, I'm getting Invictus Aqua vibes all day. Whereas Intense is like this nutty, ambery, super sweet, seductive. And I was not expecting the DNA behind this one. It's this classic barber shoppy. Think of like Ego East vibes, Platinum Ego East by um, Chanel, etc. And these as well, very high quality bottles. And you sell these all on perfumebox.com, right? Yes. You guys can save by using code Aromatics, obviously. But these are also excellent fragrances. We went through a little rundown of some of the scent profiles. If you guys are interested in that, check out the live stream. You'll get a lot more in-depth reviews. Um, we sniffed it with Chris O from, from uh, the channel Best Brand Perfumes as well. Um, Do Max has a great Sauvage interpretation right here called Fierce. And then let me take them and take you with me to the scent that you were wearing the first day I saw you here in the event. Yes. And it was nine hours after, right? Uh, you more than that, on. more than that, maybe 12 hours. Crazy, and I could smell him like four feet away. And the fragrance is this one here. Solerio Oros. Solerio Oros. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't give it much appreciation until now, because it's been pretty cold in, in uh, Michigan. Yes. It's one of my favorite ones. Yeah. Personally, I like it better than Epic, but just because, I don't know, I like the scent profile better. You live in warmer climate. Yeah, so I yeah. like I like Epic. I mean, I like uh, Oros, but yeah. Epic is also phenomenal. But they're beast phenomenal. mode. Yes. These, these uh, Solario fragrances Compliment are Compliment magnets. These are, yeah, compliment worthy because of the fact that you can smell them. Loud as hell, this is like a Hachibad, a Ventasy, just the best one, the best interpretation of that. And then Ramon Blazar, one of these blew me away. It's like this uh, Carlisle Red Tobacco beastly, beastly fragrance right here called Baron. Insane. And then these other ones are pretty niche in DNA and style. They're very different fragrances as well. Uh, I highly recommend and suggest you guys check out that live stream where there's a lot more detail in regards to a lot of these fragrances as well. Um, there are a few over there that I can see. I don't want to get in the way, but you have New Line. In Spiritus right there, Baruch, and then this is also Ra me. Ramon Blazar. The Ramon Blazar. Chris yes. O is absolutely obsessed with these lines. Yeah, this one he loves, the Ombre Rouge. Yeah. Number one. It's uh, Baccarat Rouge vibe, but much more than just that. A Priestly Amour, much more than that. This, though, is like, um, what is it, Oud for Greatness? Yeah, for Greatness. But the quality of Oud and Earth in here, it smells. I'm not going to say yeah. it is. I don't know, bro, but it smells higher quality. It's higher the Oud. For sure, for sure. The Oud in there. And then the Barouge fragrances, one of the most famous is Perlador, which is gone. No, there it is. This is actual Carlisle right here, Perlador. And then we've got like an Instant Crush-esque fragrance. It's like uh, Baccarat with Herba Pura, crazy fragrance. And the ones that you have, this is the new line here called the Tresador Intenso. This is really good for women. If you like Coco Mademoiselle, you're gonna love this one. It's in that same family of fragrances. And these are gonna be coming new to Perfume Box. Such good fragrances. I'm gonna give you guys a lot more details on these fragrances. I plan on picking all these up, reviewing scent profiles, etc. But you don't just sell these cheapies and these brands on Perfume Box. You sell niche, you sell designers that you don't own as well, yes. right? Yeah. So I noticed a brand that you have on perfume box, yeah. they're higher end, they seem. Yes. Uh, let's go look at some of the designers you have and then take a visit at that niche brand. A lot of the designer stuff that they have, Versace, Dylan Blue, I love that stuff. Machino, Toy Boy, all of the MPC fragrances, etc. <laughs> but I don't know, man, I do like Polo Blue. Do you have Polo Red Parfum? Mm, maybe, no, we don't, we don't. Versace Meno Fresh, an excellent freshie. I saw this right here. These are niche fragrances. I've seen a little bit about this before, but I never got to visit it. How do you pronounce the name of these? Swello. Swello. These are all made by perfumers. So all the top perfumers have, uh, made, there's only five references. It's a very niche product. There's not too much available. So these are five niche products. Yes. Swello is like a very rare diamond. Four. 
It's like a BVS, but it's like an even more rare. Right. And uh, so the fragrances on these are insane. The bottle. The bottle, the bottle is, itself. It's designed to look like the stones, no? Yes. It's designed to look like a diamond. It's crazy. And it feels really good in hand. And on the bottle itself. That's the name. The Grand Star de Botswana. Wow. The bottles on this is uh, crazy, man. Especially if you have like an LED lit rack. This is beautiful. What? It smells like rose water to the max. Do you know what, what's in here? So the top notes, black currant, juniper berry. It's basically the top notes. Okay. It's like a very greenish. Would you mind spraying this for me? Yeah, I got it. Holy smokes, that's a punch. Yeah, it's literally taking up every the whole room right now. Angelica seed, that's the aromatic. Black yes. currant, buds, juniper berry, oil, and then we've also got cassia, rose essential. That's what it is, bro. Sandalwood, oris. I'm also getting that buttery, rooty uh, combination of this iris oris. Guys, if you like oris, if you like rose, you're gonna absolutely love this. It's a combination of both. It's this aromatic angelica, super thick rose, but it's like this natural rose. Uh, and also with that Rudy Oris. Dude, you don't want to spray this more than like three times. Yeah, it's You'll, it's yeah, too strong. It's too strong. In a good way. What a fragrance. Then they have this one as well, which is called La Pierre Noir. La Pierre Noir. Sick bottle, man. Sick Here, bottle. Let me uh, bring out the... Ooh, off the atomizer. Smells crazy. Wow, who's the perfumer behind this one? The perfumer behind this one is Arturetto Landi. Arturetto Landi. So and there are notes of grapefruit, bergamot, plum, strawberry, blackcurrant, orris as well, lily of the valley, rose, vanilla. I get a lot of vanilla and amber. And then leather. And then and leather and patchouli. I get this vanillic, ambery, patchouli, leather. Wow. And the box on this is sick. La Pierre Noir by Arturetto Landi. It's a pink one? Yeah. This one's like unisex. La Pierre. I'm not going to sabotage the name. Yeah. <laughs> it's La Pierre Secret. Secret. Wow. Inspiration. This is like crisp, refreshing. What does it got in here? Juniper berries, bergamots, pear. That's what it is. Pear, mandarin, lily of the valley, peony, hedion, ambroxan, gyak wood. This is unisex. good. It is very rock, unisex. Despite the bottle yeah. being pink. Despite it being pink, it's pretty, yeah. pretty unisex. Yeah. And this one is called La Diamond Miracle. Miracle. Okay, the Diamond Miracle, that's what it's called. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's check this uh, one out. Who perfumed this one? I'll tell you. Gail Montero. That's the perfumer. Gail Montero. Oh, wow, dude. This is very different. Top of lavender, pink pepper, bergamot. There's a lot of pepper in the opening. It's very spicy in the opening for sure. Spicy, but I love but, spicy. Yeah. But it's also got a lot of creamy wood, cedar wood, musk. This is a good one. Dude. This is a really good one. Dude. Awesome. And then last one is this one, and it's called uh, Diamond Mystery Mysterio. I'm in love with these bottles. I'm in love with these bottles. Niche, they're 105 ml, 3.6. They're made in France. It's called Suelo Paris. These are, are these only available on Perfume Box? Yeah, right now. But you can save with code Aromatics on even these niche fragrances. Um, the perfumer for this one is? Thomas Cabaluna. Thomas Cabernala, and it's got peach. Peach, citrus, plum. Honey, clary sage, tobacco leaf, tobacco flower, oriental notes. This sounds like it's my speed, bro. Let's check this out. Ooh. 
Wow, rich mandariny orange tobacco. Rich tobacco, man. This smells like a straight up tobacco leaf. Yes. Like straight you're rolling tobacco. a cigar. But it's like mandarin tobacco. Wow. That's strong. That's strong. Dude, that's a good one. If you like tobacco fragrances, it's giving me the color of the, the bottle. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But tobacco, excellent naturalistic tobacco fragrance. They're coming out with the men's only. Cool. So uh, this was just like a unisex, but these ones are super niche. They only made one batch. So that's awesome, man. And they're yeah. only available on on so uh, perfume they're only box. On perfume box. I'm gonna be diving into all of those. So for sure, grabbing a bunch of those. But yeah, you guys are killing it. Nitros are fire. The Axons, the Dumont fragrances, they're all in a similar house, uh, except for the designers and the niche line. Dumont, you guys are killing it. The Barouge Perlador fragrances, Barouge, I mean, Barouge fragrances, it's all Dumont. Excellent work. Very nice to meet you, Diljeet. Thank you for everything. Had a lot of great interviews with the owners of Hamadi, Armoff. Uh, we met Afnan here, obviously Dumont. Met uh, Al Haramain. They have some bangers coming out as well. And we'll see what we're going to go and who we're going to go meet today. Weather out here. Look at that view back there. The mountains. It's gorgeous. Beautiful. I don't think I would have ever came to Vegas if it wasn't for this event. But there's definitely a lot to see. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be touring the city much. I'm pretty tapped out from Italy. But let's go. Manufacturer for Dumont Fragrances, Mr. Ala Al Jaber. Ala Al Jaber. First of all, thank you for your amazing fragrances. Dumont Nitro. It's my pleasure, it's my pleasure. It's amazing, that's yeah. what it is. Um, <laughs> can you tell us a little bit about you, how you started and? Actually, I started in perfume business around 30 years ago. I, 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 I was in distribution before okay. I started manufacturing. And it, for me, perfume, it is, it's, it's a dream, you know? It's, yeah. it's a passion, so it's not about uh, business only. So I started my uh, manufacturing in 2001. I started in different countries and uh, finally I opened my company, Dumont, in France in 2012. 2012. Yeah, I created this brand in 2012. Under this brand, uh, under the umbrella of Dumont, we have different brands like uh, Ramon Blazar, like uh, Sergio Valente. Okay. Plus, uh, Dumont is not only uh, we do our own brand. We do also private label for social media bloggers for yeah. in Dubai, in Iraq. Uh, and we can do man. it in our factory in Dubai or France. We have two locations. We can yeah. do it in both. Yeah. So and we have our uh, designers. So we can do from scratch. We can do the bottle designs. We can do fragrance designs. Yeah. So and and we can do even marketing. You know, we can do marketing like uh, movies, like. Uh, Social media advertisements, you know, yes, etc. Advertisement, yes, yes. But more importantly, your quality is through the roof for the price. Yeah. The portability, like yeah. nitro fire. That's what it's yes, known yes, as yes. now. You know, because our theory in business that's we need to give the best quality at a reasonable price for all the consumers. That is our target. So and so, we succeed you, uh, not only with nitro. We have. Uh, a lot of the new product like uh, Celerio, we have uh, Axon. You also create have... niche products, I'm sure, with yes, perfumers. Yes, yes, yes. So it's not just I work, a I work with role. closely with uh, most of the perfumer in Middle yep. East and France. I work, uh, we cooperate with uh, a lot of design, uh, perfume designers and uh, perfumers. Yeah. Uh, like uh, Christian Bourbonzano, like Natalie from Expression Parfumé. Awesome. And uh, Chris from Carbonel. And we are, we, are, we are working with different uh, suppliers. We are doing pure, yeah. uh, our own creation, our own design. Even the perfume is our own idea. God willing, so, we can get behind the scenes view of Mr. Ala and his Dumont brands manufacturing. I'm sure the people, I would personally love to see it, the backstage and one of these days we'll take them and show them how you make these uh, bangers, man. Thank you very bangers. much. Long lasting, affordable. I mean, quality is not compromised regardless of the, the cost. Low or high, your quality yes, is A1. Yes, yes, yes. And that's why we, a different market, we have a different, uh, you know, like category of, uh, of yeah. fragrance. So from even from the cheapest to highest quality standard quality is A standard, plus. Yes. And for yes. that reason, you will see the most success. I mean, that's what it is, quality. Yes. 
not quantity. Thank you very thank much you for, for the, the, thank, thank you for your time. Thank, thank you very you. much. Or tell us a little bit about the brand, Mr. Diljit yes, sir. Singh. And this is, we were talking about this during a live stream. Yes. Yeah. And you were this telling we were me about this one, Chris yeah. Rock was buying it yeah, or something. Yeah. That's Eddie crazy. Murphy. We've had like baseball players, NBA players, we're getting DMs from everyone. Sold out three times already. Kelly Matt. Kelly Matt, yeah. This is a fruity, lychee, sweet, unisex. Yes. I addictive. love it. Super addictive. And it's not, it'll be available soon. We're still out of stock, but we'll have it soon. Available soon. Okay. So we're here at the booth with Afnan, uh, one of the Afnan owners, main distributors, Raf. This is the man, the legend. Thank you for 9 p.m. Thank you very much, <laughs> brother. Thank you for the people out of this beautiful world of us. We're going to appreciate quality, passion, life, and just straight up good product, bro. At a value. Smell good. At a value. Smell, Smell good, good. Feel good. Live good. 100%. That's what's up. So 9 p.m. is your most viral fragrance. Yes, sir. This it's, is an excellent juice, man. Yes, yeah, we've been blessed with the 9 p.m. so we can bring it to the public at good values and make them feel good about themselves, brother. That's also, 9 a.m. 9 a.m. dial, brother. That's the next dive. revolution in place. It smells really good. Love it. People are loving it. Like I said, when you make things authentic, when you make things with passion, they everything shows up, they smell brother. smell good. Shut up, Blend the Club is also another underrated fragrance yes, as well. Yes, yes, yes. It is all a process, brother. Oh. Passion is what takes time. You know, life yeah. takes time. So Shut Off, again, is another influenced fragrance by my family back home in Dubai. You know, we, we put a lot of thought and process behind it, and we think Love of that, every man. one of you guys. Strong personality every for one strong of you guys, fragrances, Thank man. You. Thank, you so <laughs> Thank you so much for your juices, bless, bro. bro. I appreciate life, you. Life. I'm, uh, I'm here with the owner of Game of Spades. How you doing, brother? Very good. How about you? I'm doing really well. These are your fragrances. These are the new fragrances, correct? Yes. Diamond collection. This is a diamond collection. Diamond, ruby, yellow, sapphire, and gold. Nice. And these are, are they launched yet? Yes, it's been launched. Okay. Really sick bottles. And your fragrances, they're made where? Uh, made in France. Made in France. Awesome. These are niche, correct? Niche, yeah. It's, uh, the retail goes for uh, the new line is 320. 320 for the, the, the new line, but I see you have an upgrade on the presentation on the packaging. And, Pretty uh, sick. And uh, the line we have before is 220. And these are 220, but they smell really strong. And we also launched a discovery set. Discovery set. Pretty sick. Pretty sick. And this is, uh, you could see that uh, the bottle it's is magnetic. Ma magnetic. That's awesome. Metal, and it's... Uh, Whoa, okay. I did not so expect can, that. That's pretty sick. Yeah. Sick. One of my favorite ones currently, you guys, is this one right here. Game of Spades Moon. Oh, Milano? Yeah. JoeMilano.com, you guys. Check it out. We're done. No more event. Gonna go get some food with Dumont. What's up? Uh -huh. <laughs> Light draw red. Uh, yeah, man. Made some good new friends. Diljeet is another good friend. Rock and uh, Oros, Solario Oros, it's projecting like crazy. I, w I find this like more of a Hachibot. Yes, sir. Yes. Beastly projection. Hachibot, yes. Beastly, all day. Let's go eat.